At only seven years old, Porter Yoakum is teaching his school about the importance of finding a cure for cancer. I think there's some for people with cancer, or mostly children, um, can live. What do you guys think about that? His day at school started with an assembly to teach his classmates about the St. Baldrick's Foundation. And moments later, his talk turned to action. Everybody make a little noise for Porter. He let the owner of DeVere's and his principal shave his long locks to raise money for a cause which has devastated his family. Because I know how it feels for someone you love to die from cancer. Last August, his great-grandma passed away from cancer. Porter wanted to do something to honor her memory at his school with the help of all of his friends. I was hoping to raise 500. I already achieved that goal, um, I think. His principal couldn't be more proud. Very moved. For a second grader to come up to the principal and say, Mr. McGill, this is important to me. Can we do a fundraiser for this? Uh, it just kind of shows what type of young man he is. Porter's mom isn't surprised her son got his entire school at Phoebe Hurst behind his fundraiser. He's super, super empathetic, and he's very, like, he has a big heart, so... It's awesome. We're so proud of him, and it's great to see what he can do when he sets his mind to some things. For a family who lost their Nana, giving back is a way to start healing. He was super close with her, so he took it really, really hard. So just, again, trying to channel that into positivity and how can we help other families to not feel what we were feeling. Phoebe Hurst managed to raise $600 in one day, and that means that Porter gets to shave Mr. McGill's head on Friday. In Sacramento, Leticia Ordaz, KCRA 3 News.